In today's video, I get five plate appearances with Way Boggs. Every time I get out with Way Boggs, I need to drink a beer. Every time I lose a game, I need to rip a 50 bundle. Now let's see how drunk I get by the end of this video. <laughs> Him Boggs is first at bat. He didn't quench my thirst and hit a single in between short and third. We're not having a repeat of the chili dog challenge. With Boggs on first base, David Wright smashed a home run and gave us a 2-0 lead. Oh, yes, sir. The ass pounding wasn't over yet. Yes, no! 3-0. After stringing a couple outs, our opponent thought he was out of the woods. But Bryce Harper had other plans for him. Wade Boggs, at bat number two. Shut up! Foul ball. Fuck. No, 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 oh no, I gotta drink a beer. First beer. Holding on to a 4 1 lead. I brought in Mariano Rivera to close out this game, but my opponent hit an RBI double with Miguel Amaya, cutting the lead down to 4-2. to two. Next up, he had Riley Green hit a shitty RBI double down the third base line. Mariano was not able to close this game, and there was no outs still. I had to make a change quick. <laughs> Jesus Christ. And I brought in Aroldis Chapman to close out this game. After getting Bryce Harper to strike out swinging, he got Brandon Lau to pop out to Mike Napoli. And that was a GG to our opponent, Pointy Egg. After the game, me and Wade Boggs took a private flight together. And we had a competition to see who could drink more beer throughout this video. So stay tuned. And don't forget to hit that sub button, because we're almost at 6,000 subs. Game number two started off how game number one started off. Yes, sir. No beer for me. After a scoreless first inning with my ace on the mound, P5 Randy Johnson, he gave up a home run with a man on first. Nikki Tubax hit a single to Bryce Harper, who forgot how to field today. Randy Johnson loaded the bases. He's not looking very ace-like. So I brought in a roll this Chapman. Dude. Is this game the fucking stupidest game in the fucking world, bro? After giving up that liner down the first base line that cleared the bases, I gave up another run. In the bottom of the second, I was able to hit a home run with the bringer of rain, Josh Donaldson. But that was all I was able to muster up. I'm having fun, guys. Down six to one. In the bottom of the third, Waybox got another opportunity to hit. But he flew out to left field, so you know what that means. You're number two. Since I lost the game, my punishment was to open a 50 bundle. But stay tuned to see me drink more beer, because I'm a fucking idiot. At this point, I don't know what's more painful. Spending stubs on packs, or actually ripping them, and getting absolutely nothing. I'm having fun. I like fun. This game is fun. I can't believe I'm ripping packs and there's nothing in them, but I'm happy for myself though. How are you, bro? My stomach's gonna explode. I'm a fucking idiot. As you can see, this punishment is the most painful thing in the world. The only thing I was able to pull in this 50 bundle was a purple Matt Chapman that literally goes for quick sale value. Me and Wade Boggs are taking our final flight to the Costco Stadium, but this ain't like any other Costco Stadium. There's a wolf fucking a bear. Who's gonna win this drinking competition? Me or Wade Boggs? Fuck you, man. Beer number three. Ah. After being unable to score any runs in this fucking bad box stadium, I gave up a home run. Uh. At this point, I wasn't feeling very well because before I started recording this video, I did a chili dog challenge that will be out next week. Even though I wasn't feeling well, I was able to string up a couple of hits that Mike Napoli get out of this fucking miserable park. With a three to one lead, I got the worst hit 
in the history of MLB The Show with Booger, a.k.a. Larry Walk. Then Way Boggs, the star of the show, came up to bat and did this. Bye bye ball, we do not care. We'll take those all fucking day. The ass stretching didn't end there because David Wright, bye bye ball, hit a perfect, perfect home run, which gave Mickey Mantle another at bat. Remember, you chose this stupid stadium. Remember that. And this is on you. Going into the bottom of the second, I had a 6 1 lead, and I ignored my pitcher stamina. As you can see, Nolan Ryan was getting tired, but I didn't give a fuck. And I kept on giving home runs to players who have no business hitting home runs off of Nolan Ryan. I wasn't able to add any more runs in the top of the third. This fucking stadium is actually insane. My opponent was able to cut down the lead to six to four. With a man on first, John Franco stepped off the bag. And in typical SDS fashion, the game ended off in a- In a freeze off? Are we in a freeze off? Did I, what the fuck is going on here? Did I lose connection? Uh, hello? SDS? Ramon? I got the win, I don't care. Eat my fucking dick. See you next time. If you enjoyed this video and want to see me do more dumb shit, check out my Big Mac challenge. And don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe.